Hi! Um, I wanted to do a video just to show you what I bought today at Boots and I wanted to have a little rave about a product that I bought recently which I really really love. So I went to Boots today to get a mascara and I was going to get another um, Max Factor False Lash Effect mascara which I bought um, probably February or so and um, I really love it, really like it. Um, love the big brush. I don't normally like the plastic brushes, I prefer the more bristly uh, ones. Um, but I've got on well with this one and I really like the big lash effect it gives. I have had a few troubles getting down to these bottom lashes and into the corners because the brush is quite large. So I really went to buy another one of these because the other day um, I do like the L'Oreal Lash Architect um, mascara. Um, so I bought this the other day, but this is the same product but in the carbon gloss. And I don't like it at all. Um, I really love the plain black one, but this one's just, it's brittle, it flakes off, it doesn't seem to come off very well. Um, with my eye makeup remover, I always have a ring of um, mascara afterwards and I just can't get it off and then when I wake up in the morning I've still got like panda eyes so this is not so good but the plain black one is brilliant but I watched a video from Lollipop26 the other day and because I love her and she's brilliant and um, I went and bought the um, Maybelline uh, lash stiletto which claims to be the ultimate lengthening mascara um, she really liked it so I thought I would give it a go I saw it the other day was gonna get it never used a Maybelline mascara so I avoided it but um, based on what she's saying I'm gonna give it a go so I bought that today so I'm excited to try that tomorrow and then um, I also bought this um, which is a, pearl, a new product, it says Pearl Drops Instant White um, Natural Brush On Tooth Veneer and it's supposedly brush on your teeth and um, it makes them look a little bit whiter and it stays on until you brush it off at the end of the day um, it's probably a little bit gimmicky, I'm not sure if it really works um, but I thought it would be something nice to try. I just have a couple of teeth that I would like to um, whiten up a bit. The rest of my teeth are fine. I just have two that are a little bit um, more yellow and I want to make them look a bit whiter. So I thought I would give this a go. I'll let you know how I get on with it. And I also went to the barium um, section because I really, 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 really want to get the nail paint in mint. And they have it on their website, but I haven't found it in the shop yet. And I keep trying every week, every few days. I've been going to Boots and to Superdrug. And again, Lollipop26 has got it. And um, it looks really gorgeous. I don't really want to buy it online because it's the only product that I want at the moment. Um, so I begrudge having to pay a couple of pounds to have it sent out when the polish itself is only a couple of pounds so I'll wait till it comes into the shops but I'm going to get that but Boots have got an offer on at the moment of um, two nail paints for five pounds so I got two um, I got this one which is a really bright pink and it's called Shocking Pink and it is a really really bright pink love that uh, these are creams and I was saying the other day in my China Glaze video that I'd bought all shimmers so I wanted to try some creams and um, so these are really good and I bought this in another pink called bright pink which is really cute um, I think that would look really cool on my nails so that's what I bought in Boots today um, on that same note I did buy two Barry M's the other week from um, Boots as well under the same offer I bought this um, vivid purple you can see the colour it's really nice haven't used that one yet but I have used this one which is called turquoise and it is gorgeous I've got it on my toes right now and this colour is what made me want to get 
this one because it can't keep those two well together. One of my toes, one of my nails. So I can't wait to try this out. The only problem I've found with these is it's chipped off my toes a bit. But I have had it on for probably a week. So yeah, it's not done too badly. Um, so yeah, I'm going to try those out. So that was what I bought at Boots. And a product I wanted to have a little rave about is something I saw on um, Blair's video, Juicy Star 07. Um, I love her, she's really funny, um, she's really cute, I just, I can't stop watching her video, she's great. And it was um, a product from Lush, and it's called the Therapy Bar, Massage Bar. And I then went in there not intending to buy anything, and I had a look round, and I, I saw this, and remembered I'd seen it in one of her videos, and she thought it was amazing. And it is, it's fantastic. It smells delicious. It's full of um, cocoa butter, uh, sorry, shea butter, yeah, cocoa butter, neroli oil, um, lavender, and it comes in this bar. Um, it usually has sort of um, a knobbly bit there that you're supposed to use to massage your skin. But it's, um, it comes, it, it's really oily and really good on your skin. I've been using it at night and going to sleep, cocooning myself in my duvet, and I've been waking up with beautiful soft skin. And she's right, it does give a beautiful shimmer sheen to your skin, which you probably won't be able to see. But basically, you just rub it on your body like this. Warm it in your hands, rub it on your body, and you get this beautiful massage oil. Um, it's probably a bit, I'm, I'm not sure if you're supposed to use it as a moisturiser, whether it's supposed to just be a um, massage therapy, but I love it as a body moisturiser. I'm definitely going to get another one of these. I have to say, I've only used it twice, and the knobbly bit goes the first time you use it. Um, or maybe I've used it three times, but the knobbly bit goes the first time you use it. And I have to say it's probably half, well, a third of it's gone, I think, and I've only used it a few times. So a bit extravagant to use every day. But it was only... I not say how much it was, but I think it was about £4, four fifty. But I would definitely, definitely get another one of these. And um, I did try to smell some of the others. But this smells so delicious. And I swear it helps me go to sleep, actually. It's probably the lavender and the neroli in it because it really relaxes you. Oh, it's amazing. I'm definitely going to get another one. I'm going to check out a few more Lush items. Um, I have tried some of their face products and was a bit disappointed with them. But for the body, I'm definitely going to try this out again. Uh, perhaps some of the other flavours. Um, maybe some of their shampoos or something like that. Okay, uh, that's all for now. See you soon.